Hey everybody, today we are going to do the partner pieces for the rhythm wraps. So if you haven't already done so, make sure that you master the rhythm wraps from last week's assignment. And uh, today we're gonna expand upon that. Okay, so if you open up your book to page 20 and look at number 67, pepperoni pizza. So pepperoni pizza is the same rhythm as number 66 rhythm wrap. Okay, pepperoni pizza, pepperoni pizza. Okay, so we're taking that rhythm and we're adding our left hand to it. Okay, so obviously make sure you can pluck the rhythm wrap, clap the rhythm wrap, play the rhythm wrap, make sure that's perfect before you try the pepperoni pizza. And then when you learn pepperoni pizza, maybe pluck it first. You can also air bow it first and then try to put it together, okay? So there's a couple of steps you wanna to take to get really good at it. Okay, for today, my metronome is on 74, and let's play pepperoni pizza together. If you wanna pluck it with me the first time and then bow it, you can do that also. Okay, here we go, pepperoni pizza. <clears throat> One and two and three, four. Next one is 69, D major scale up, which is the same rhythm as 68, okay? Hamburger, cheeseburger, hamburger, cheeseburger, okay? And again, you probably wanna pluck it first, air bow it, all that good stuff. In this piece, we see two mistakes generally. People will either play the quarter note too long, okay, so it starts to sound like this. Right, rather than kind of a zippy quarter note. Okay, and the other mistake folks make is they play the eighth notes too fast. So you want, the, you want them to be very even. Okay, so metronome on 74 again. Here we go with number 69. One, two, ready, play. Okay, next one is 73. This piece is quite difficult, so we're only going to do half of it. Okay, so we're just gonna do the first four measures of Buckeye Salute. Definitely gonna have to do some plucking on this one. Maybe write in some letter names, write in some finger numbers, drill some of the skips, you know, maybe do the second measure four or five times repeatedly. Um, but don't try it with the bow until you can pluck it for sure, okay? And again, it's the same rhythm as 72. So you already know the rhythm. You're just trying to add the fingers to it. Okay, so 73, and we're just going to play the first four measures. Okay, here we go. One, two, ready, play. And if you want to learn the entire piece, go for it. Um, if you can play the, that entire piece, you are doing awesome. Okay, and the last one is 75, two by two, which is the same rhythm as 74, you guessed it. Okay, so metronome at 74 again. This time I have two beats in a measure. Okay, two by two, one, Two, one, two. 
Okay, so pretty challenging day. Um, my classes typically work on page 20 and 21 for a, at least two to three weeks. It takes usually about four or five classes to get people through all of that. So, um, you know, don't worry if it's taking you a little bit of time. Just keep at it little by little, day by day. Work on one measure or one section at a time and you'll, you'll get the hang of it. Okay, good luck.